today, we're gonna to be answering our first question from goaskpace.com. All right, so somebody wants to know what are some powerful ways a connector can make money like gator wrestling, connecting acquisition wholesaler to a disposition wholesaler, a person with a lead to a closer, private money to a deal, unicorn agents, et cetera, especially in a highly competitive environment. Okay, the question actually goes on and on and on, but you get the point. The question is, how do I make money as a connector? It's one of our avatars in our avatar series. So click the link down in the description. You guys will get a whole video on avatars. There's a four hour video we put on YouTube like two years ago, changed the game for so many people. In fact, I hired a personality profiler, somebody who is going to go through all of the avatar series, make it a little bit more robust and give heartier descriptions to each one of those avatars. Stay tuned for that, but go down in the description and you can find your avatar. If you're trying to get into real estate or lending or anything in this sphere, you should know your avatar. So click the link down in the description below. I wanna cut in here while we're making this video and let you know that we have the Squad Up Summit coming up. Go to squadupsummit.com to join. I'm gonna tell you why you should be coming. You should be coming in and learning creative finance, creative deal structure, creative lending, creative paperwork, all the things that creative finance is changing the game with. My community is coming out, Sub2, Astro, Gator, Vina Jetty's community, top tier transaction coordinators are coming out. All the people that do the, the creative finance paperwork, yeah, you're gonna meet them there. So if you feel like you're an island out there, like maybe you've read this book, right? You've read Wealth Without Cash, you're like, okay, what next? Cool, well now you know what you can do, you know what's possible, but who's going to help you get through it? You've gotta meet some of my leaders in the community and the best place to meet them is at the Squad Up Summit, April 23rd, 24th, and 25th in Orlando. I wanna see you there. I'll be out there hanging out, some of the best speakers. I'm gonna be the main real estate speaker. Jamil's gonna be the main real estate speaker. We'll have Vina Jetty and some other people, but it's actually gonna have a lot less speakers than most events. While everybody else is trying to cram speakers and give you way too much information, we're gonna be building your business live. We're gonna be giving you homework right there live. We're gonna be guiding guiding you through it so when you walk away, you've actually built something, you've done something, and you've squad up with powerful leaders in my community that we've been building for years. Go to squadupsummit.com. I can't wait to see you April 23rd, 24th, and 25th in Orlando. Get back to the video. So connector is the avatar that they're referring to. Here's how you make money as a connector. It's very simple. I feel bad even making this into a video because some people are gonna be like, wait, what? That's the whole video? Guys, this is what you do. Let's pretend you're one person and then let's pretend you're a second person. First person, you join our free Facebook group. Our free Facebook group is Creative Finance with Pace Morby. We talk about Gator, Sub2, Seller Finance, Wraps, Cars. I call it Planes, Trains, and Automobiles. We do all the things in there. It's a free Facebook group. We have 125,000 members, 2,000 people join every single week. We are the dominant, and in my opinion, the only creative finance Facebook group that you should ever join. The other ones, they get like three posts a day. We get three posts a minute. Highly active, a lot of activity going on in there, which is where you wanna be. So let's say I'm brand new. I'm not in Pace's community, sub to Gator, top tier TC. You're not in any of those communities and you're like, I need to get started somewhere. So I'm gonna go connect with Pace's leaders inside of the Creative Finance with Pace Morby Facebook group. Well, if you are a connector avatar, you should be going in there and asking everybody to get on a call with you, introduce themselves and start chit chatting with people and say, what do you have, what do you need? And you're gonna run into people that say, I have money, but I don't have deals. And then you'll run into people that have deals, but don't have money. So what you do is you call both those people and go, hey, if I was able to find you the missing link to your business, would it be okay if we put in writing that I was able to make money on a transaction that I connected you to, even if I wasn't the closer, even if I wasn't the this, or even if I wasn't the that, if I could just connect you, can I make sure that we get me paid? The biggest problem with connectors is they just connect. They're so damn nice. They don't put any responsibility on anybody. They're just like, hey, Ingrid, meet Eric. And then they go off, they have a relationship. There was no expectation set. And then they go make money together and you're over here going, oh my gosh, Pace, I'm, I'm a connector, but I'm not making money. It's because you need to make sure you're connecting the dots in your brain on making sure that you have a JV agreement. And we'll give you a JV agreement in the description below. Let's say Ingrid says, hey Pace, I see you're new to the Facebook group. Here's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for sub two deals in Arizona. Okay, shout out Ingrid Hernandez. She's actually in the studio with us today. And she says, I'm looking for sub two deals. Perfect. Then I go to the next person and the next person, the next person, the next person. I talk to 15 people and one person's like, yeah, dude, I gotta find a buyer for my sub two deals in Arizona. Oh my gosh, that's what being a connector is. It's literally just go fish. It's like, do you have the match to what I need? That's it. 
And so when you find the person that has the match to the thing that the other person has, you then have this conversation. Hey, would you be okay if I referred you to this person and I was cut in on the deal? They'll go, yes. But if you ask for it after you make the referral, I'm sorry, but human nature is like, I already got the thing that I need. So make sure you have JV agreements. We'll give those to you in the description down below. Now, if you are a sub two student in the sub two community, this is very, very easy. It's a vetted community. It's as good as it will ever, ever, ever get in this industry. What I would be doing is as new members of sub two join the Facebook group, they typically, I'd say 80% of them announce and they go, I'm a new sub two student. I live here and this is what I'm trying to do. Perfect. What you do is you make a comment. There's other people that make a comment too. And you go, let's connect, get on my calendar link. Let's do a Zoom sometime next week. I'd love to talk to you for 15 minutes. You do that enough times every single day. That turns into a money making endeavor because what you do is you run into people and one guy goes, I have a million dollars. I have $10,000. I have $5,000. I have a deal. I have this. I have a multifamily opportunity. I have a, you find all the opportunities that people have. And then you connect them with the people that want those opportunities and you make sure you have a JV agreement is so easy. So that's how I would make money. If I'm a sub two student, it's really easy. Just do it inside the community. Same thing with Gator. The free Facebook group is a great place to start. However, you're typically going to want to connect with the students, not with the non-students because the non-students are typically kind of like the blind leading the blind. So hopefully this is helpful. Eric, did I answer the question? Okay. Eric says, I answered the question. If you guys want me to answer more questions in the future, go to goaskpace.com.